25 yards. Hey, 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 there he is, right here. Oh, Kraken. Release the Kraken. Chasing specific bucks is something Clayton and I have been doing for several years now, uh, most often resulting in not a lot of luck, but uh, it's a lot of fun to try and pick out mature deer, give them names, and start keeping tabs on them. Skyler, son of a buck, Kraken, right here behind his car, dang it. Oh God, he's gonna get your wind. History that we built with Kraken in 2019 was pretty bizarre from all the close encounters then that final time he slipped by my dad last day of season and just could not wait to see what he was going to do in 2020. Well it's actually a miracle that I'm sitting here. I had hip replacement surgery two weeks ago this morning and uh, uh, thank goodness they got him up and around not very fast but didn't think I was going to get a chance the rest of the season, but our number one shooter, Kraken, uh, has been out on this food plot the last couple of nights in daylight, and last year I kind of messed up and waited too long. He got past me and uh, ended up shooting a bonus buck last year, but random, but but uh, hopefully we can get her done and uh, get Kraken down this year. Smokes. That 
we had boogered us up so many times tonight, I thought, oh my goodness, it's not gonna happen. He came out right where those does went in. I already know this is special seed. The test date's on my birthday. 621, planning for the 2021 season. And the other good thing is usually I'm eating radishes and turnips, but this has kale in it. So this is gonna mean like super, super food for me, not the deer. Have you ever had kale in the oven? No, I'm not your a rabbit. Wife, guarantee your wife's done kale in the oven. I'm not a rabbit, bro. Guarantee. Dude, one All right, let's, let's go. go. Let's go. Load it up. Let's put it in the bucket. Fertilizer cart. Slingshot engaged. Go. Mario cart. Go, bro. Oh yeah. One acre, so half a bag. We'll be set. You ready? Ready when you are. Looks like he's already ripped up the dirt, and I'm gonna spread the seed. He's been in the air conditioner. I'm gonna do the hard stuff. Let's cut my butt off. The plots are done. Oh, I'm starting over. I'm starting over. <laughs> well, the hard stuff's all done. The hard stuff is all done. Food plots. Heat index is only 101, I think. But now it's the fun stuff. Gonna check cameras and bomb them. We got the spot picked out. We've been stabbing right through here. What do you think about bombing them, bro? <laughs> Thank you, no, that's it. no salt bait. Here, pull a classic Clayton and just like lick that off your arm and try it. <laughs> we were really excited to hunt Bootstrap and Kraken. After all the previous years of history and, and getting the more recent photos of them throughout the summer, but we dedicated the first part of the season to my son Jack and trying to get his first deer for him. And that was perfectly fine with me. It was something I've always dreamed about. And I knew that later in the season, we'd probably get our chance at one of those bucks. Wow, what a shot. He's yeah, gonna go buddy. down. He's not gonna go far there, is he? Right in the heart. So Mike, that shot. Ringo. Up to me on top. I'm getting thin. I'm, I won't deny it. I'm milking it though. Can I keep standard cut as long as I can? I'll buzz it one day like you. Oh my gosh, we haven't done this in forever, man. I'm gonna get my boots. Show up. 
was six years old and that deer is at nine lives. There's two big old bucks that are after. Missing Kraken was absolutely gut-wrenching and made me sick to my stomach and was losing sleep over it and I just knew as elusive as he was before that this was our best chance at him and I let it slip right through my fingertips and knew it was still early in the season, we had the rut ahead of us and the hunt for redemption was on. Gonna give her a whirl right here, might hit the rattle and antlers, so we've also got Mr. Kraken, our number two, which I missed last time. First time back in the saddle since doing that, so time for a little redemption, a little payback.
absolutely another heartbreaker, man. I thought he was going to loop around and come right down the road just like we would want him to, but nope, he just kept going. Got our wind. Unbelievable. Plenty of daylight left. Maybe Booter Trap will come out, man. That's my only hope. Maybe it's just not meant to be. It almost seemed as though Kraken was toying with us. I mean, the emotions and roller coaster that we were on was just so frustrating by this point. He was always a step ahead of us. He constantly was literally looking up in trees and seeing us. We're just new. He had to get around and get downwind. He had this extra sense about him. I've never seen a deer so cautious. And I just knew it was gonna be a long shot to get another chance at him now. back behind. 
behind us here chasing does in the field. He might actually nudge him this way. I don't know, man. I'm going to hang tight here. Let's see what happens. Yes, just smoked him, baby. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Do it. Do it. Do it. Is it right through him? Man, it was, that was so far out. I couldn't, I couldn't. That was unbelievable. I cannot believe it. I cannot believe it. I cannot believe it. That's cracking. You gotta be kidding me, dude. 25 yards. Nose up, nose up in the air. Yeah, right there. Dude, I thought it smoked him. I thought he was like gonna just fall over out there. I just, I can't. There's too much stuff in the way, but I think I got it, man. Oh my gosh, right there as he turned. Man, I thought it was like high long. Whew. Tell me something good, dude, what it look like? <laughs> Come on. It's done. I don't know why he didn't fall. What? I don't know why he didn't fall. Dude, he might have fell, I don't know. There was deer running everywhere. <laughs> oh my gosh. That's the buck, bud. Are you kidding me? cracking pin right here from the boys I missed that deer I think it was October 23rd I love you boys I missed him at 35 it just felt good it felt so good he started walking I wasn't gonna stop that sucker he won't stop for anything he'll run where is he we decided to give him a little bit of time and uh, pick up the blood trail right here. It looks really good already. Just spraying all over this. Look at all that. I mean, that's a lot, man. Looks like he's going left. Oh, there's a, there's a bunch a little bit. He's spraying out both sides, I guess. Which makes sense. There, he'll pass through. He's gonna, it's up there on that grass. See that? I see, oh, I see the red blood right on this stick. It looks like he's going over a cliff. The creek's right here. You say you see him? Yeah. Oh my gosh, I see him too. He's in, oh my gosh. He cannonballed into the creek, dude. <laughs> Are you swimming or me? <laughs> I might be able to reach him. Holy cow. 
what the heck, dude? He ran into the creek. Look at this. <laughs> can, you, can, you, can you see him? Look, he's right there. Holy cow, he just cannonballed into the, into the creek. Oh boy. <laughs> well, he yes, died. Sir. I'd say he died pretty quick. Now I gotta try to get him out of there. Yeah, baby. Oh my gosh, we did it. Uh, get him out of here. <laughs> He's huge, man. Uh, holy cow. Unbelievable. I can't even believe that worked. Kraken. Game over, buddy. We were talking about this buck. Literally nine lives, no joke. The neighbor shot him when he was four years old. We put tracking dogs on our property, tried to find him, determine he was alive. Sure enough, he was. He slipped by Clayton twice in bow range. Slipped by my dad late season that year. Then last year, my dad missed him like the last day of season. And then this year, he actually got smaller. We think he's six years old. Me missing him this year and him slipping by, me drawing back twice on him a few nights ago. It's just literally unbelievable. And thank you so much, Clayton, for sticking with me, man. He's filmed me the last few days on this farm knowing I wanted to get this guy so bad, so, so bad. And look at it. The story of Kraken is over. The end. I, could, I mean, I could talk forever about this, but that right there is the end of the story. I'm cracking. Feels great to say that. You're getting a big old hug, dude. Oh, we got our chore. We got a chore cut out for us tonight. We're gonna have to get him out of here now. Fucking truck. Fucking uh -huh. truck. Yeah, yeah. Fucking like truck. Uh -huh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What you got? Rattle, what do we think? Give me a little rattle, rattle, rattle. How cool would it have been if you rattled him in with those? Oh, I thought about it. He probably ran the other way because he's like, oh, there's a big bug over there. All right, let's wow. hang him up. The story of Kraken was one for the ages, and it was just so surreal for the story to end. I mean, I could not believe it. After all those years of history, it was something unlike we've never experienced before. I wish every deer was this way, you know, living that long and having those ups and downs, but it just super rare and it's one that I'm not going to take for granted and I just hope that one day we were spoiled enough to, to have a story like this again with another deer. Low batteries a month ago? Just my luck. Oh, 48 pictures? Look, look at this. Still has the cardboard in his hat. Turn, turn, other way. Other way. Look at that cardboard in his hat, bro. Put this in the credits. Put him on blast. Town, this is a town, go to town hat. And we don't get those sweat marks across the top of there. It's just common sense. Get out of here. Like recycling, using the, using what they put in here already. Hashtag old man props. All right, we're getting excited. Jack's first deer hunt is underway. They're about to show up. We've got boss man here, granddad. This camera's got autofocus, so even he could run this. You just tap the screen, like where you want to focus on. It's, it's brilliant. He could be my new camera guy when Clayton's MIA. Get out of here! Woo! Come here, baby! What are you wearing a cardinal shirt for? What do you got, buddy? Did you get a good nap on the way? What's this weekend? Deer season. Oh, uh, Paw Patrol. Oh, we got Boss Man and DL Magoo over there. <laughs> oh, lucky there. Maybe just a little bit more. How about a here we go for the credits? Here we go. <laughs> Got a little trigger happy. Hard to pass up a coyote at 15 yards. <laughs>